Welcome into the Red Fox Report. Tommy Armstrong here with William Rosen. We got a ton of action to get into. Let's tip off with basketball. The Red Foxes look for their first win of the season in Richmond in Virginia. Their head coach Chris Mooney looks for his 350 win with the program. Maris down six with five left in the first. It's Jackson Price from NBA distance. He would have five threes in the half and finish with a career high 20. To the second, Richmond down three. It's Delani Hunt on the breakaway. After Maris miss, it's an and one. Hunt would score nine straight with the Spiders and finish with a career high 27. Maris up two past the two minute mark. Jaden Collins Roberts sets up his man, Josh Pascarelli, for the catch and shoot triple. Maris shot 50%. The next Maris possession, Collins Roberts runs the point, but he's blocked by a Postaglu's Rumaglu, but emotions would get the best. That would be a technical foul. The Red Foxes would sink eight straight free throws after the tee to close out the win. They'll face Army in their home opener on Friday. Maris football looks for their first win in Florida, trying to snap a 13-game losing streak dating back to October 2023. Five minutes in, Maris at the goal line. Sonny Menino keeps it, gets his blockers left and into the end zone for the score. An opening drive touchdown for Maris. Second quarter action, Maris up 13-7. Anthony Benzia sits in the pocket, flushes out right, takes it to the house through contact. The backup quarterback doing everything he can to keep Stetson on top. Third quarter, Maris trails by two. Menino immediately forced to his right, using the legs once again. It's a 30-yard house call to give Maris the lead. Menino finishes at the game's leading rusher with 91 yards. Fourth quarter, Maris is trying to put on the finishing touches. Menino doing his best Lamar Jackson impression this game. Breaks a tackle at the goal line into the end zone. Four rushing touchdowns, a program record, and the first quarterback to do it. Maris picks up the win. It's Maris versus Quinnipiac in the MAC quarterfinal matchup. 17 minutes in. Who else? It's Evan Marks with the cross and buried it in the goal by Arian Yula. His third goal of the season puts the Foxes up 1-0 into the second half. Richard Morrell awarded a penalty. And what does he do? He sends it to the back of the net. His team leading seventh goal of the season gives Maris a 2-0 lead. 15 minutes later off a set piece, it's Quinnipiac's Ramesh Del Saus. He scores his second of the season, cutting Maris lead to one. 20 seconds left, Maris down a man. QU looking for the equalizer, but backup goalie Drini Adrizi says no. Quinnipiac has one more chance with 10 seconds left. The corner is taken quickly, but it's Evan Marks with the defensive stand. The Foxes win 2-1. They'll play Iona on Thursday in the semifinal. Women's basketball 0-1 to start the season, looking for a home opener win versus Cornell. Close game to start the second. Emily Pape the three at the top of the key. Cornell extends to a four-point lead. Maris down one, looking to get ahead. Julia Corsentino with the steal and the finish to close a 12-2 run by Maris to take back the lead. The Red Foxes ran with that in the third, up nine. Danielle Williamson adds to it with a splash from three. First, second three of the quarter, 42-30. Maris, halfway through the fourth, it wouldn't be easy. Cornell down seven. Azarea Kilgo, bag work, tough bucket plus the foul. The three-point play cuts it to four. All tied up with 335 left. Maris needs a spark. It's Williamson again. Knocks down the triple. The freshman stepping up in the big moments. Next possession, Maris still up three. Pick and pop. There's Morgan Lee with the clutch three. Maris holds on to win 62 to 56. What a weekend for the Foxes. Alongside Tommy Armstrong, I'm William Rosen. Thanks for tuning into the Red Fox Report.